From wherever you're receiving me now, I welcome you all. Today we're about to witness the test and the evaluation of fillet fracture tests. This consists of the opening of the roots of one side fillet while the sample by applying a certain amount of force until the root opens. Okay. Unlike the macro stretch, which focuses on the cross section area of the tested piece, fracture test focuses on the entire length of the tested sample. By opening the root, this provides a good indication of discontinuities within the entire length of the world being tested. So in front of you, you can see the sample being cut and then from there after it is being prepared, we're gonna go in the lab and proceed with the test. We've seen how we prepare our sample prior to testing. So this is a sample which was prepared for fracture testing. As I said, fracture testing is at some point or some extent an alternative for macro test. We got an alternative for macro test. So my plan here is to try to put pressure at the side. So that I can open the root of my sample. You have to see how well the world fusioned with the parent metal. This is the parent metal. So this is how I'm gonna put my sample. I'm gonna make sure that the world is facing upwards. The world is facing upwards, you can see. And then the back of my sample is facing downwards. And then I'm gonna apply force, okay? until I have an opening at the back of my sample. Right. So there we go. First thing, check, check what's going on there. So, it's opening there. So and then from here I can down I can then check and tell if my fracture is passing or failing. You can see that it is open there. This is actually just a sample as you can see. So it has been opened there, right? And this is how it came. This is how it came. So we put pressure there, okay, until it's open, as you can see. So I'm gonna try to draw for you how thus operate okay i'll try to go for you so this is actually your sample that the horizontal that is uh the horizontal plate and this is the vertical plate okay and then it welded there okay so when you apply pressure here when you apply pressure there okay so you try to bend this one down as you bend this one down you're opening at the bottom there but if for example this sample okay was having a good fusion okay between was having a good fusion between the world okay and the parent metal what's gonna happen is the world's gonna take a part of the parent metal away because there will be fusion there okay so for you to evaluate if this is possible or failing if it's acceptable you need to check okay the thickness come on the thickness of your plate okay after it goes to the thickness of the, of the plate you're expecting you're expecting a reduced thickness to be right there on the right so this is a good example of the fracture which is possible so if i can measure the sides okay and lock it i lock the side when i come here and i come here so check flash huh? it's flash that side and that side so now check you see the tip of my vein yeah, is into the world it's into the world All right so this is passing but in this other case the tip of my vein yeah, check the tip of my vein yeah, that was 12 so in this other case the tip of my vein, right? The tip of my vein is hitting the parent metal. That is the parent metal. Okay. So here, the tip of my vein is hitting the parent metal. It flashed this side, but it's hitting the parent metal. But here, 
it's flash this side but it's eating what the world eating parent metal eating the world so this one here is bossing and that one here this one here is failing right so if we have to as i said fracture test is at some point in some extent the and the alternative to macro test but the difference between fracture test and the macro test is for macro test we consider only one face the face where the saw blade passed okay so we're actually considering one point if i have to draw for you how the plate came okay so you're actually considering one point okay so one point of the whole plate so that point there so that point is where we consider let's say we cut here and then we come and consider this point so macro test does not give you the full uh sight of how good the world is okay because considering on one face or one point but the good thing about the macro test we can see we can evaluate more on how the structure or the flow of the world is okay but for the fraction then what you consider is you consider the length the length where the world was done or how the world was done yes of course there is a normalized length when it comes to how you have to cut your fracture i think it's 150 millimeter for iso okay but so if you have to consider evaluation of the fracture so you go along the length you go along the length okay so to give you an insight of how good the world is along the length but does not give you a good insight about the flow it you might get a good insight about the flow but not about the structure okay not about the runs okay because it's the length but the macro is the face the point so you consider the only right so i needed to share this one so we know that welding is a big part in today's joint or today's structure so it's a very good thing to make sure about how we weld and how this goes right so it was a pleasure of mine sharing this video with you i hope that you enjoyed it i hope that you're gonna enjoy it and catch you in the next video bye